Hey guys, Fire, welcome back to the Minecraft video, and today we are going to solve the Rubik's Cube in Minecraft, and yeah, and I actually do know how to solve it, so this shouldn't take too, too long, but like I just learned like a few weeks ago, so I kind of remember the algorithms and everything, so yeah, um, yeah, so this is a Minecraft Rubik's Cube in Minecraft, um, <laughs> and Seth Bling, made by Seth Bling. Why do I keep repeating that? Um, but yeah, Seth Bling made it. It's really cool. It actually works. You want to rotate like a face counterclockwise in that way. Yeah. Okay, I can like turn my sound stuff. Nope. Oh well. Okay, so yeah. You can rotate it counterclockwise if you want that to go there. And yeah, so you can keep spinning it. And then it'll do it itself. And then there's kind of or just normal clockwise, and it'll go to the right. So yeah, I'm breaking. It. I'm breaking it. I'm breaking it. Yeah. So before there's actually a, you can reset the um thing here. But yeah, I, n I never really noticed that. But I'm not going to use it. So yeah, I can do it on my own. So let's let's let's, let's randomize this up, man. Randomize it up. We are in the new snapshot. I don't think we need the new snapshot, but why not? Um, so yeah. So you just place this in the middle and I'll turn. And yeah, so we can just mix it up as much as we can. So yeah. Um Okay. Uh let's just keep going a little more. Um more. Come on. Uh, okay, that's good. Alright, um, so, yeah. So, we're going to do the bottom side first. Yeah, we're going to do the bottom side first to the top. So, the bottom side first is we're going to get the first cross and then layer and everything. Okay, see so yeah, Oh, sorry. Alright. Okay, so, see how there's um, a yellow, a yellow, and then a blue. So we want to match this blue up with another blue, which is right here. So we want to spin this. Uh, okay, so now it's like, now it goes yellow, yellow, blue, blue. That's what we want. So yeah, and then we're going to, okay, so next we have to try to get another yellow in. And since it's already like this, yellow, and then there's two greens next to each other, then we can just spin this face to the right. And many of you may or may not know what I'm doing, but I am... I can solve it in like a minute, so, so yeah, <laughs> I'm so cool, no. okay, so yeah, um, <laughs> now that, um, this is a yellow and red piece, so this piece has to go here, so we're gonna, um, what do we need to do, we need to, um, move this to the right, and move that back. Right? No, it did it backwards. Okay, so we're gonna. Uh, we're gonna wanna. Um, where is it? Okay, it's up here now. So we wanna move it to. Okay, so we're gonna spin this twice. Then we can. Spin that twice. And then. We can put it back, I think? Yeah. There we go. Okay, so now um, we have uh, yellow, yellow, green, green, yellow, yellow, red, red, um, yellow, yellow, blue, blue. I would just need yellow, yellow, um, orange, orange. And where is that little stinker? Where is the little stinker? <laughs> okay. Um, where is it? Oh, there, no. Oh, there it is. Okay. <laughs> okay. Probably you guys saw it and they're just like, nope, nope. Derp. Okay, so now all we have to do is get it connected. So we have to move that to there, and we can just spin that counterclockwise, and then we can turn that twice. And there we go. We have the yellow cross done, and that is what we want. We also have these two all lined up. Um, but yeah, so there. Okay, so next we have to get the corners in, and I'm going to. Okay, so yeah, so to get the corners in, you need to find the blue and orange face. That's right here. So 
let's get the color so this between the blue and orange face since it's orange and blue or blue and orange so well doesn't really matter but yeah so we just rotate that clockwise and then it's here and then um yeah so it's between there um and then we can just move it out of the way bring this up move it nope move it back and then we can bring it down well, boom yeah now we have that corner in and see how it's like um it's it's lined up orange to orange blue to blue and then yellow to yellow and then next we need to get the next corner in so I'm trying to I'm trying to get one on this face but if there's not I can just go here so if we want to get so we're, we're trying to get it on the top face so we're gonna want to turn this to the left move it um, okay. okay like that we can move this back right no we have to move it okay, we have to move it one more time uh yeah oh god oh god did i move it did I, did, oh god okay no. um now we can just move this to the right i believe oh i failed all right we have to do that again okay where is it where is the piece it's right here okay so we gotta get this to so we gotta spin it okay gotta move it to the yeah we gotta move it to the left now okay. and then so this is a different piece so <laughs> and then we can move this back so boom now yeah so now we have one up here so we have to get it between the blue and red face right here so right yes okay so I just move this backwards and it's here okay okay good and now we just do what we did before. So move it out of the way. Bring this up. Move it back. And move it down. Whoops. Okay. And whoopsies. Okay. And move it down. Okay. So now we have two corners in. And yeah. And now oh, they're still both on the bottom. So we're at the do the thing we did before. I want to move it back I'll move it that way leave yeah and then we move this back again and so now we have this in the top layer so now green and red so it's actually already in the right place S all right so um move it away bring it up whoops bring it that up back and move it down yay and now yay okay so now we're just one thing away one little QB away and we'll be good so luckily this one stayed up on the top and the orange face is this face so I have to move it once so now it's in the correct position just we gotta get it down here so if we move that away and we bring the, bring that up, bring that, and bring it down. Okay, so let's see we got the yellow face done. Um, we also had this first layer. Um, it's all it's like a T or just a line, and it's all connected and everything. So yeah, um, yeah. So now we have to get the these um, edges. This is kind of hard on this Rubik's Cube, pretty easy on the other one, but yeah. <coughs> so the top face is white, so we have to find a piece where there isn't a white piece. So I have to move, so this is one, <coughs> um, orange and green. So it's, so I have to move it, so it's, it's lined up, the green piece, and then the orange, so it's on the left. So I have to move this um, away. Right? Oh, I have a Rubik's Cube to help me. Okay, so. Uh, okay. 
and then okay. Wait, I don't want to do that again. So up. Hang on. Can I hear the spinning of the cube? All right. So now. Okay. So we need the top. Top. Nope. Clockways. Clockways. And then we move. Hang on. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so hard. Um. Find it. Okay, so. Move. Move this down. There you go. And then we need to connect this. To there, and it is the orange and green piece. So, boom, move away, bring it up, move it back, move it back, and now you can see that this edge piece is in its place. So, yeah, so now we're just gonna try to get all the edges, and then we can move on to the white side. So, See, this edge is actually already in its place. It just flipped weird, or backwards. So, we can fix that um, by just doing that move again. So, hang on. So, wait, hang on, what do I do? Okay, so, move this clockwise, or counterclockwise. Yeah, and then we move this to the left, so cut block like this one. And move this back, so back, so clockwise. And then, so hang on, let me get it back where it was um oh my gosh okay so okay so what did I, okay so now we move this down again i believe uh no we're okay so we move the front face i am totally unsure um move the front face and then we can That, 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 and that? Is it in? No, okay, I did it wrong, but yeah, so what do I need? Okay, so, oh wait, no, he didn't. Okay, perfect, I did it right. So, the, since that was in the wrong spot, or no, 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 it was, it was red and green, so I think, no, it was red and blue. No, it was red and green. So, th this piece right here was down there. And since it was rotating correctly, I got it out of the way. And I got it onto this top layer. So, we can just put it in now. So, get it on its face. Now, we turn the top backwards. Move this to the left. Move that back. I believe that down I can just what do we need to do okay I need to move it that way so uh, clockwise counterclockwise counterclockwise okay <laughs> so now we got this edge piece in so that's good um and now we still have this side done so this could be a little bit longer of a video. Um, I'm probably not going to cut it at all. but Because I, I kind of enjoyed this already. Never really tried solving a Minecraft Rubik's Cube. So uh, yeah. And I'm so not used to it. Because like I'm used to just messing around with my hands. And I don't have to like remember the algorithms. Algorithms are like a set of moves that you do. So, yeah. So yeah. Um, so I don't really remember the like algorithms. But I do remember like what do sort of
but yeah. So, um, okay, where, okay, next piece, so blue and orange, we need to get it down here, then we, then we would just have this one left, so we need to move this out of the way, and move this one up, move that back, move this down, yep, and where is that little stinky piece, okay, there it is, okay. So I'm going to move clockwise, right? Clockwise. And uh, clockwise. And now we have this edge in. Now we just have one more to do, and then we'll have this, fa this yellow face, and then we can have all, like, the two layers on e each side. And then we can just do um, the rest. And, uh, yeah, so... Where is the blue and red piece? There it is. Okay, so <coughs> so we want to move it that way, and there we go. And then we can move it out of the way, bring it up, and then move it down. Okay, so out of the way, bring this up, move it back, and then move this down. And we just have, where is the yellow piece? Right here, okay. Oh, what did I do? <laughs> what did I do? Okay, uh, I think we can just move this clockwise and then we can do, oh, I don't actually have to do that. Do that. Mm. So boom. And then we can move that. Boom. And then, boom. I didn't do it right. Okay. I see. Okay, so now we just have to do it one more time because I did not do it right. Okay, where is it? Okay, so we just turn that. Okay, so. Okay, okay so. Move it out of the way. Turn. Okay, so. Move it out of the way. So we move it all the way, bring this up, move it back this way, and then bring that down. Yeah, okay, then we can move this all the way, boom, boom, and a boom. Yay! Now we have this edge piece. Yay! And now we have this side and all these edges and all these corners. Now we just have to get the top. So to do that, we need to get the top cross like we did on the bottom, the yellow cross, and we can just do that by a few situations that we have. And this one, we have this L right here. So, and we're gonna want to put the L on the top left um, side of the cube, so right here. So we're gonna do, want to do. The, I remember this L algorithm. I call it the front, the fart algorithm, <laughs> because you do like front right top and then it's like fart without the a so yeah <laughs> um so front right top right inverted top inverted front inverted i think yeah so now we have this line right here so we can just do that again <laughs> um so yeah so front right top oops up, right inverted, top inverted, front inverted. There we go. So now I have this top white cross. And yeah, so we're actually really close. Actually, well, we're kind of close. But, um, so yeah. So next, we need to get these, these, um, these, um, what's it called? These, um, edges right here in place. So this one's in place. And this one's in place, but this one, nor that one, is in place. So we can, since um, it's they're across from each other, we can we have to do this move one no yeah one more time, which is right up, right inverted up, right up up right inverted. Uh, what did I do? 
What did I do? Oh god, did I miss Mex what? What? I, I think we can get this back, hang on. So we can just do right uh, so on the left. So we're gonna bring this one up. Right? Hang on. Hang on a minute. Bring this one. So right inverted. This should be right inverted, so left. No. Yeah, left inverted. So we can tune this to the left. Spin the top twice. And then we can put this back down, I think. Yeah, so now we have this on the top. So um, we kind of messed up there, really sadly. Um, so we can just, now we can put this one in. Let's piece it in. Uh, so this is a lot harder than it is on the normal Rubik's Cube. So where is that piece? There it is, all right. So let's turn that twice. Um, oh, three times. <laughs> there we go. Now we boom, 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 boom. Okay, now we have to do the a few edges again. We just have to do one or two this time, sadly. But so we kind of failed, so we gotta gotta make up our work. And the crab's actually almost done, which is, I, I don't know if it will be done. I don't. But yeah, so, to move this to the right, so now it's connected, so we're gonna run them all the way. So we're gonna move it out of the way. Right? And then. Yeah, okay, so. Move this to the left and move it back. So, so um, I'm just, I just have a Rubik's Cube next to me um, to do it. So, okay. Oh, hang on. Okay, so. So, we can do. What am, what am I doing? Okay, let's pretend. Oh my gosh, okay. Um, I actually, <laughs> if I missed one with this Rubik's Cube, I actually got the second layer done. An accident, so. Let's get that undone, even though I just redid what I just did. Hang on a minute. Okay, let's just try to. Okay, I don't know, but. So we go. Here, since we're trying to get this piece there, so how do I bring it up? Turn the top to the left? Yeah. And then, and then there should be a piece, I believe. Is that not yet? No, so we go. So back down. Whoopsies. Where's that? Okay, hang on actually. Oh hey! <laughs> oh, nothing happened. I I don't know what I did. Okay. <laughs> I don't know, but okay, let's um where's okay, let's just try this again. Uh Okay, I got that piece in. I did not cheat, I swear. Um, so I, I just kind of did it, and uh, yeah. So it's just really hard in this game. So where's that? Oh, yes, okay, so. Move that over. All right, so now we have to get this piece in, so we can do that one more time. Okay, so. Away, up, back. Down, I believe. Yes, and then we can spin the top to the left. Left, up, up. There we 
we go. Okay, so now we're back to the phase where I am at the cross. I was like, okay, sweet. So <laughs> I kind of went right to the cross. Uh, my phone is closed. Okay, my dad just texted me. All right. So, uh, yeah. so lately, because I have not been on the computer very often, is that so? Because I've been messing around with these Rubik's cubes. Um, yeah, I just, I just, I just kind of like them now, and they're really fun. And yeah, so I, I actually ordered like a Mega Minx or something. Yeah, a Mega Minx. That's what it's called. I, I actually, I, 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 yeah. <laughs> so yeah, and it's like this really like it's like a pentagon and stuff. So yeah, I got that, and I also have a four x four coming. So <laughs> yeah, uh, I kind of, I'm kind of getting into the Rubik's cube. Oh God, I almost shot that. But yeah, so. That's why I'm doing this, and why I've not really been playing too many videos lately, but, yeah, so, um, right, left, right, left, right, left, left, right, right, okay, so, right, up, right inverted, up, right, up, up, right inverted, okay, <laughs> so, now we have... Okay, so now we're in a good position. So now we actually have three sides solved, which I don't really, it doesn't matter. But we're, you can see we're pretty close to solving it. Um, we just have to orient these corners correctly. So yeah, um, and none of them seem to be correct. So yeah, um, so we just did a move that uh, switched around the, uh, the uh, what's it called? These edges. So yeah, next we have to do, um, how do we do it? Uh, what do we have to do? So here, let me let me just get this solved real quick. I'm be right back, dudes. All right, guys, I am back, and I actually uh, did the algorithm on a Rubik's cube and stuff. So yeah, let's see how this goes. I actually wrote down the algorithm, so it should be interesting. Um. So I want to look at the uh, face where if there is one done that is like in the right place but unpositioned correctly or just positioned correctly and in the right place. So um, you're orientated. So yeah, so there's nothing here. So we go up, right, up inverted, left inverted, and then Up, um, I think it's right inverted, up inverted, and then left. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so I have to change that right inverted to in right inverted. Which is right in the first place, but I changed it, so I'm so cool. No, okay. <laughs> All right, so there we go. So now we actually do have a piece correctly orientated. So we have to do that one more time, or a few more times, maybe. But so up, right, up inverted, left inverted, up, right inverted. Up inverted, left. There we go. Okay. Um. Okay. So we have to do that one more time. <laughs> I thought all of them were all good, but I guess not. So we do that one more time. Um. I really need to change this. Yeah. So this this sheet of paper is very helpful. Okay. So now we have to do it with the. Remember, with this corner on the right side, do up, right, up inverted, oopsies, left inverted, and up, right inverted, up inverted, left. Okay, now we are at the very extremely easy part. Um, 
So, uh, now you notice that uh, we have two correctly orientated, and two that are in the right spot but are not orientated correctly. And yes, yeah, so we're just going to orientate them very quickly. Not too hard at all. So, uh, we have to do this move called the, well, it's not really called anything. It's, it's the right inverted, down inverted, right down move. Um, I normally do it like with the side because it's faster. But, um, yeah, so we can't really move this cube. So, yeah. So we have to get one of the unsolved corners to the right, on the right side. So we have to go right inverted, down inverted, right, down. And then we have to do that one more time. So right inverted, nope. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. One more time, I think. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. Okay, so, and then right inverted, down inverted, right, down. There we go. Okay, so now we have to twist the top to the right to do that a few more times, and then we'll have the cube solved. So, right inverted, down inverted, right, down. And then a few more moves and right inverted, down inverted, right and down. Oh, oh, okay, one more time. Okay, no, we we don't have to do it one more time. Okay, so we have to move this to the right. So we got the Rubik's cube solved. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I don't need these things anymore. I, I'm the master. So I yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm not like looking at a YouTube video or anything. I just have this Rubik's cube. Whoopsies. I just have this Rubik's cube right beside me. It's kind of helping me go along. But uh, yeah. So hope you guys enjoyed. Or leave a like if you enjoyed. A pretty, pretty long video. But it took a little while to get like, uh, you know, the Rubik's cube solved. So <laughs> normally it takes me like one minute in the normal. Well, like a minute 30 in my normal world. Because I'm used to like muscle memory and all that. Uh, so yeah, I, I don't remember every single like move and what's called. So yeah, so yeah. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to leave a like, as I said like five hours ago, or like no, five hundred times. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you then. Peace.